Hey everyone, Joel Lance here. Today we're in Martin, Tennessee. Yes, Martin, Tennessee. Kind of like, well, it's a bit away from Nashville, a bit away from Memphis, kind of like in between the two and a little bit further north. So today we're outside the grind. Yes, the grind, mac and cheese and burger bar. Here to do you guys their crazy big burger challenge. I believe it's called the Grind Gauntlet, if I'm not mistaken. So this is a, a 10 burger challenge. Yes, featuring 10 other burgers, maybe a Nashville hot chicken sandwich in there. We are close to Nashville after all. Um, I know you have 30 minutes to complete the challenge. We do get a meal for free. Uh, it is currently undefeated, so that's pretty cool. I believe the value is like 100, maybe 150 bucks. So it's a pretty hefty price tag, but these are definitely some really good looking burgers. Place known for like crazy milkshakes. Um, they're kind of crazy burgers. They do like peanut butter on some. Um, I'll give you some more details. But yeah, super, super cool. Um, place is very well known. People are driving like 60, 50, whatever miles to come for this experience. And apparently they have like secret menus and all this kind of stuff. So let's head in, let's have fun with this food. And that, let's go eat. Hi everyone, so here with all the food. So, so, so many burgers. This is absolutely insane, but it all looks really delicious. So in front of us, we have the, I believe it's called the Star Spangled. It's like the traditional one. I have the Luther. This is actually a donut burger, which is super, super cool. There's like cheese sauce, everything on it. I have the SoCal. We have like uh, guacamole, uh, kind of like a Southern California style burger, which is awesome. We then have uh, this one here, the Gambler. It has like barbecue sauce some ham and stuff on it. Then have uh, the Farmer's Daughter, I believe it's called. So this is like a breakfast burger, guys. I love breakfast burger. We're talking a runny yolk on egg. We can see that just dripping down the side. Looks absolutely delicious. Of course, we have their Nashville Hot. Guys, we're basically in Nashville, Nashville Hot. I have the El Fuego. This is the spicy, spicy burger. So this has um, a whole bunch of uh, guacamole, pico de gallo, but also has ghost pepper cheese on it. It's jalapenos. We have the lumberjack here. So this is giant. You guys can barely see this. This is huge, multiple pieces of Texas toast, two patties. It's kind of like a little bit of a variant on a Big Mac. And then back here I have the King, which is a secret menu item burger. Oh, no, this one right here. So it's like a uh, encrustable, so it's like peanut butter jelly, like the King Elvis. Close to Memphis, we are also close to Memphis here. Pretty cool, bacon, all that good stuff. And then last but not least, we have the uh, Holla at Your Boy, which has their uh, kind of stuffed jalapenos on here with a raspberry jelly so oh it's really really good guys i'm super super excited i mean we do only have 30 minutes to complete the challenge although we do we do get it for free and a free t-shirt so that's pretty much that so with that let's get started here just momentarily where am i going to start that is a good question um also are the pickles part of the challenge too yes. and the pickles are part of the challenge so we have two pickle spears good size pickle spears as well maybe i'll start with the pickles all right five four three two one, let's eat. This is a full restaurant, everybody just got really quiet. Like I said, you guys don't have to be quiet. Thank you. All right, pickles, down. I'm gonna try out this delicious looking SoCal burger, looking good. Guac and all kinds of aiolis and everything. Mm. Oh yeah, fresh. Oh, and they brand the buns, so it's pretty cool. Really good tasting beef. They said it's like a proprietary blend that they get made especially for them. It cooks perfectly. I just keep filling the holes. We got the classic burger cheese, onions, pickles, lettuce. Delicious. That bun is actually fantastic. It's a brioche bun. Man. Delicious. All right, got some ketchup action going. 
Honestly, that was a great burger. Simplicity at its best. This is the El Fuego. This is the one with the ghost pepper cheese. Pretty spicy. I'll try it. We got some nice guac on here and pico de gallo also. Mm. Okay. Oh, there's a bit of heat to that. Okay, okay. The avocado is really good. This is this is hot. This is dang hot. Better pick this up if we're gonna do it. This is the lumberjack. Lumberjack. So it's like a Big Mac. It's huge. Two patties. Rock and roll. Texas toast. I like that sauce on it. Giant burger. Very huge. Guys, this is a lot of food. These burgers don't play. Great value, too. One downfall having hair on my face. It gets messy. Delicious. All right, we got so many options next. Um, maybe I'll do this one here, the farmer's daughter. This one, the egg, the breakfast, it has a hash brown on it. This is one of everybody's favorites, and I think it'll be one of my favorites too, so here we go. Guys, eggs on burgers. Eggs on burgers are the best thing ever. Shout out eggs on burgers. And again, huge shout out for properly cooking a burger, guys. It makes such a difference. Mm. So moist. And juicy. I think we're coming on 10 minutes in. Yes, right at 10 minutes now. 10 minutes, we're half done. A lot of food, very delicious. I'll try this um, bacon style, or the barbecue style burger here, ham, barbecue sauce. And then these, I kind of kept for last because they're all like the soup, in my opinion, they're like really, really, really unique burgers. Well, this place is a whole unique menu. They got like, the craziest milkshakes. Let's keep on trucking. That ham, good flavor, that hit. Shout out to everybody watching, I appreciate it. We got people outside, people all around us, so it's, it's a pretty funny spectacle. Yeah. Yeah. Holla at your boy, like jalapenos, stuffed jalapenos, raspberry jam, secret menu item. Okay, woo, that is interesting, but a good interesting. The sweetness of the jam and the pepper, the, the taste of the jalapeno, it's oddly complimentary. Actually still 
pretty spicy. Some jalapenos can be really spicy. These are pretty spicy. Actually, that raspberry jam, it's actually a really good addition. I like it. All right, here we have the king. So peanut butter jelly, bacon action. Like Elvis, Elvis reference. He likes sandwiches with peanut butter and bacon. Ooh, and cheese sauce. Wow. Okay. That is really good. It's really like, thank you. I've never had an Encrustable before, guys, but it's peanut butter, jelly, and salt. And like, really good. This is, this is another secret menu, right? Woo. Give that one a try. And there's mayonnaise on it. Guys, wow, that bite was so much peanut butter, and it's hot. Like the warm peanut butter, mm. melt in your mouth. Delicious. All right, guys. A lot of food, but we were making our way. That king was fire. Fire, fire, fire. Now, Nashville hot, which they said is pretty hot, and that El Fuego they also said was pretty hot, so that's probably pretty hot. Excuse me. And then, the Luther with the donuts and cheese sauce and bacon. Let's go to the Nashville. We'll finish with dessert. Woo! All right, got some coleslaw on this, some pickles. Let's see how, uh, see how spicy this is. Mm. High end. Woo! It's building. It's building. Really good though. It's like a aioli on there or something. Very nice. Last one, I should have undone the belt. We'll give you some more horsepower. But, I got gloves on, so I can stay clean, but. Woo. Definitely a gauntlet. They should call it the gut busting gauntlet. The Ryan gut busting gauntlet. That's what I would name it. All right, guys, donut burger. This is actually coming from a donut shop right next door, made fresh every day. Woo. Get some air out of me. Here we go. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah. 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 Wow. Okay. That was the best thing ever. Oh my. Mm. The warm donut. Oh my god. Look at it. Oh my god. It is like so warm and soft. That richness, that beef. Oh my. All right. This is a game changer right here. This is. They said people come like 60 miles plus just to come get their items here. I would drive 100 and 162 miles. That's how far I drove from the airport this morning for this. So well worth it. I, this is bomb. Wow.
the Luther. Hell right. No pun intended. Last bite. Last bite. I, I, I would have just, I would have taken 10 of these. <laughs> so good, guys. We can make it happen. <laughs> I couldn't eat another jam. I'm full. These are substantial burgers, but delicious, everybody. So official time. Official time, 22 minutes, six seconds. Seriously, that Luther. I'm just gonna start with that. Just wow. That was like, so I eat a lot of burgers, don't get me wrong. And I love burgers, believe it or not. People probably think you get tired of burgers. That's probably one food I have never gotten tired of. Now you want to talk about pancakes, that's a wholly different story. But, woo, that's some air. Compliments to the chef, all of the chefs. But that Luther, honestly a game-changing burger. That was one of the best burgers I have had in an incredibly, incredibly long time. And I ate that last. You gotta realize, that burger probably sat there for like 30 to 40 minutes because I'd take photos and then obviously I ate all the other ones. That was still so warm, soft, and gushy. I, I could only imagine what that would taste like, like straight out the kitchen. Because as even, even if at 40 minutes old or whatever, that was the best thing ever. Wow, all right. Woo! The rest of it. Sorry guys, my mind has been blown by that Luther. That was like legit game changer. Um, the other burgers, really delicious. I love the King, that peanut butter, that jelly aspect was just so, so, so delicious. There are so many good bites here. The uh, California burger was delicious. That standard was great. But anyway, for winning, we do get a meal for free. We do get a sweet t-shirt. Guys, but like that was awesome. So. The grind, um, they are known for their macaroni and cheese, they're known for their burgers, and their crazy, crazy milkshakes. Everything here is Instagrammable. Super cool people, they're like, they sing, and you know, they, when they bring certain things to the table, they're coming for occasions. Really, it's like a destination slash like experience restaurant. Like literally, they had, and I appreciate it, even though I told them it wasn't necessary. They've been like, they're like, we're gonna try to keep it pretty low key for the video. But guys, they are like singing, they are cheering. Cool spot, like I said, destination and unique spot. Martin, Tennessee, guys, it is a happening location. But um, at that, huge thanks to everybody here. Appreciate you guys watching, appreciate the support. Thanks so much, everybody. Thank you guys, thank you. Again, there's people outside the window, I'll give them a salute. Um, <coughs> but yeah, so awesome, really good experience. Martin, Tennessee, guys, it's very memorable and uh, great food. So if you're ever in the area, stop on by the grind. And if you wanna make a trip out here, stop on by the grind. Try that Luther, you are not going to be disappointed. Now, I would definitely recommend trying a couple different other items over the span of a week. Don't do what I do. I ate all this in one sitting, you do not have to. But that being said, if you do wanna try the challenge, you can. Do they need like advance notice or do they just show up? Okay, apparently you can just show up and try it, so. That's about that, everybody. That's about that. But uh, like I said, I got no complaints. I have no other words. They do have a crazy amount of other really unique items on the menu, like those crazy milkshakes. I've been trying to avoid dessert. Maybe I'll try. Maybe I'll try one. Maybe I'll try one. Fun fact, they also told me. I think it's like, what, if you finish a milkshake, it's on un like unlimited refills or something like that? That's right, that's right. If you just finish one by yourself, you get late refills. Like, free. that's how insane these milkshakes are. You can get free refills if you finish one of the milkshakes, which is nuts. Free refills on milkshakes. Where does that happen? 
Well, I guess I answered my own question. Martin, Tennessee. But like I said, everybody, till next time, stay happy, hungry, happy eating. That's about that. So, till next time, have a good day. All right, so I did decide to order a milkshake. Being this is crazy, so they call this a strawberry... Strawberry short shake. Short shake, which is not short. Like, this thing is actually massive. Here, let me, let me fix this a little bit, guys. This is huge. This is, like, ridiculous. And, all right, you guys have a secret menu. Can I see it? Absolutely. I'll be right back. Okay. So they have this secret menu. I know we have, like, all the burgers and stuff, but... All right, my friend. The contents of this briefcase are considered to be top secret. Ladies, if you wouldn't mind shutting the windows for me. Wait, 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 what? Okay, here, let me do this. All right, he has a briefcase? Oh yeah, very top secret, sir. All right, this middle envelope, please leave the menu inside of the envelope until I tell you you can remove it. So ordinarily, you're breaking my rules already. It's supposed to be a camera-free zone, but you're helping us out. So we're gonna let it slide for you today. Now, whenever I tell you to go, you're gonna have about 35 and a half seconds to look at this menu. Please keep the menu as flat on the table as you possibly can while you're looking at it. Do not share any of this information with anyone around you. And if you have any questions for me, please do it out of whisper. Do you understand the rules? Yes? All right, your time starts now, sir. All right, hold on, I gotta say this. Look at this. They're literally blocking the people with menus. Okay, so hey, buddy, you're you talking to a chicken. Okay, uh, all right, secret menu. Well, flat on the table, buddy. Flat on okay, the table. Okay, it, it is secret menu. Special access required. Holy hey, crap! Bro, you can't read that loud. All right, well, all right. I guess I got a whisper. Jeez Louise, though. This is. Oh wow, that looks cool. Oh, I might have to. Uh, I might have to dive into one of that. That sounds really hey, good. Hey, hey. There's nothing funny going on here. Jeez Louise. Maybe I'll get a, maybe one of those there. That looks pretty good. Okay. Well, you know what? We're going to have to make sure your server finds out about that, sir. I'm just delivering the menu. Okay. So, All right. We got about 10, All right. 9, 8, 7, 6, back. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Thank you, sir. Now, a quick question for you. Yeah. What have you seen here today? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. You must have done this before. All right, guys. The eagle is landing. Wow. I don't even know what to say. That was... That was... I don't even know. That was hilarious and nuts and... Wow. This place is an experience. Holy crap. That was... Ask for the secret menu. All right, so now I have three giant shakes in front of me. This is insane. I'm not eating them all because I would die. But guys, we have a chocolate freak. Chocolate freak. So there is, looks like chocolate cream, chocolate sauce, cocoa pebbles. What, what's, what, what else we got in there? Uh, there's a chocolate donut there on top. There's a Hershey's Kiss in there. Oh my gosh. We've got a chocolate clear bar hidden in there. It's like, there's literally so much in this. It's just not... And this chocolate cake as well. We like to say you get chocolate wasted. I don't even know, yeah, I don't even know how that all fits in here. But it's like... 16, 18 inches tall. This is the Oreo one. Which looks insane. There's so much freaking whipped cream. We got a Klondike bar. There's an Oreo Pop Tart down there. Um, the Oreo cereal. And then, of course, this the freaking strawberry one I haven't even tried yet. So let me, uh, I, I'm just going to try with the strawberry one first. The strawberry milkshake. Ooh, ooh. That is good. Very, very sweet. So much whipped cream on this. Right in here. There's the strawberry shortcake ice cream bar back here also. More whipped cream. Wow. Guys, that is so good. You can see the, the popsicle stick. And it's funny, they, they, they said this is kid size. And I was like, you're what? Meaning it's the size of a kid. And they are not wrong, guys. Fruity pebbles and icing. That is a good strawberry shake. Mm. Chocolate, freak chocolate, chocolate freak. I got a Hershey Kiss on top. 
All right, boss. I hope you say some more. We got some more the Mary. Oh my lord. Oh yeah. This one's a little interactive. All right, we get to the fun one. Okay. Do you like your marshmallows uh, a little on the well done side? Um, light, lightly toasted. Lightly toasted. Okay. We got marshmallows being toasted in front of me. What we all going here? There you go. Man, we got a bunch of stuff. We got cinnamon toast crunch around the edge, the party cereal. We got the Hershey's in there. We got some s'mores, some s'more marshmallow uh, whip under there. All kinds of good stuff. Chocolate drizzle over the top, man. Holy crap, guys. Well, thank you. Yes, sir. I am, thank you. Enjoy. I think I'm going to probably die of uh, high blood sugars, but nonetheless, got some Cocoa Pebbles here. You said there was cake and chocolate. I'm gonna try a sip of this chocolate milkshake. Woo! That is chocolatey. There's even an ice cream bar in here I see, because I see a stick. I don't even know what all is in here. I'm gonna try to bite everything, but. There is so much chocolate in there. Is that a cake? Brownies, I think. Woo! All right. Guys, that is rich. Oh my God. Talk about chocolate. This is like a slap of chocolate in the face. And they poured the chocolate all over it. But holy chocolate. I'm gonna move this one again to the side because this is, this one I feel might fall. There is so much on here. I don't even know if I can get like, how do you even eat this? Like that's literally a question. Wow, yeah, there's uh, some ice cream in that. This is insane. It really is the craziest milkshakes I've ever seen. All right, now I have four. I only had three a minute ago. This one is the secret menu one. All right, now this one we got Oreos, a Klondike bar, a Pop-Tart, Oreo milkshake. <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo. Oreo. I'm gonna try to get this off the top. It was so much cream. Mm. I'm gonna grab a. Uh, try to get this. Oh, somebody got the secret menu happening beside me. I won't look. I know the drill. They're blocking me now with the menu. Mm. Klondike bar. All right. Crazy delicious. Is there like a better way to eat this? This is insane. You just gotta go face first. Crazy guys, look at this. There is so much. Alright. Next one. The biggest. Guys, these are absolutely insane i don't even like again i've had big milkshakes before <laughs> nothing goes like that but then this one is i don't even know what's in this one what are we s'more it's called s'more the merrier s'more the merrier so what what do we got uh, obviously some cream and marshmallows oh my gosh Woo! That is sweet. Oh, slap. Oh, wake you up in the morning with the chocolate. Oh, my God. Graham cracker in there. Everybody. Marshmallows, roasted marshmallows. There is something right in here. I think it's another ice cream bar, maybe. Guys, this is the craziest thing I've ever had in my life. Literally. So good. Again? Uh, $10.99. $11. Guys, that is the most economic milkshake I've ever seen or heard of in my life. Do you see the size of these things? Ten bucks. What the heck? 
This will literally feed multiple people. It's like a meal. And this is why I said they do a all like a refill your milkshake if you finish this. Because they are this big. Which is nuts. I'm probably gonna go into a diabetic coma here. But man, this stuff is dang good. Not calorie free. Nor sugar free. But oh my god. And I love s'mores and this is amazing. Every bite is so much chocolate, whipped cream, marshmallows. Crazy. Well, that's it everybody. I've had more than enough. I'm heading out here. Martin, Tennessee is too much fun. And the grind specifically is absolutely amazing. This is better than anything I've ever seen. Any of those unique experience restaurants in LA or New York or anywhere. Martin, Tennessee. Crazy. That's it, everybody. I don't know my words. These are falling apart, and I'm about to fall apart. Stop on by. Get yourself a milkshake. And that Luther burger. This is nuts. That's it, everybody. Until next time. Wow. There's no better word. Phenomenal. Hey, guess what? You rock, yes, you rock. Thank you so much for watching the video. I totally appreciate it. I hope you left me a comment down below. I'd love to read them. I hope you also liked that video. Hey, by the way, click my face. You can subscribe. Yes, subscribe. That way you always get my uploads. You won't miss me when I'm in your town. And I also picked two videos for you. Yes, two videos I know you'll love right here. So watch one of those, hit my face. And at that, thank you so much, you rock.